Hi, I'm Matt. Argo have asked me to provide the following information to help ensure the connection of your Argo cooker can be completed on the day of delivery by following this simple pre-installation connection guide. This simple setup guide is designed to present you with an overview of the essential requirements for your new Arga ER3 series cooker. For full information, we highly recommend you refer to your installation guide available on the Arga website. Should you need to make any alterations to your electrics, then you need to seek the services of a qualified electrical contractor. Check number one. For an ER3 series cooker, such as this one, you will need an accessible isolation switch that is within two meters of the cooker, but not above it, and in the same room. The Arga will need a dedicated 32 amp electrical supply using a minimum six millimeter feed direct from the consumer unit. Check number two. The main connection point should be within two meters of the bottom corner of the cooker on either the left or right hand side. Alternatively, it can be fitted behind the cooker. If you are fitting behind the cooker, it must be no higher than 450 millimeters from the floor and be recessed into the wall. Check number three. If you have chosen an ER3 series cooker with an induction unit, then an additional 13 amp power supply will be required. This can either be a three pin plug or a switched fused spur. As with the main Arga connection, this needs to be within two meters of the bottom rear corner of the cooker, but cannot be above or behind. This connection must remain accessible. If on the day of delivery, it is not possible to have your electrical connections in place, then we are still able to deliver, position and set up your Arga, ready for your electrical contractor to make the final connections at a suitable time. Once this has been completed, your Arga is ready to use. You may want to check out our handy self-help guide on switching on your Arga for the first time.